Greetings, Internet. Hello. And welcome to Aaron Plays. Well, Aaron and Anna plays now in, in, for these episodes anyway. That's right, yes. Um, so, yeah, let's not be too selfish. So, Aaron <laughs> and Anna plays. Um, we're continuing our playthrough of this war of mine. And we are now doing episode nine, which will be turn eight of this game. I need to have ticked that previous one. And, yeah, there we go. So... Episode 9, turn 8. <sighs> Starting to get tough. Mm. Um, okay, our characters don't look too bad, but um, we're starting to run low on food, remembering that we want to get the f as much food as we can so that we're not hungry by the end of this uh, yeah. as our objective. Mm -hmm. So let's go down to the map and see what's going on. Okay. <laughs> Okay, well, we've still got snipers in effect. That was really nasty. Mm. It really limited what we could do last time because I didn't want to get multiple characters wounded. Um, Roman got through, picked up some bits and bobs, managed to evade, avoid some thugs. So, we've now got a death, we've built a death wall, deadfall trap so we can eat rat burger. Mm -hmm. um, we've still got one place to go through in the house, which is over here, the, the rubble remnants. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, the first thing we've got to do is draw the event card. Oh. You see the chapter three card is now going to be visible. Yeah. Right. So, add three to the cold space to so start to get cold again. Mm-hmm. So we need three of them now. Oh, it's getting bad. Okay. Uh, all right. That just means we've got to get some wood and... Uh, we've got to start sorting something out. Okay. Mm -hmm. Food shortages. Oh, yeah. great. Remove the following tokens from the box, not from the storage, into the waste bag. Oh, I see. So we've got less to, to actually we can draw from. Okay. So one canned food, two raw, and three vegetable. That's mm. not good. That's bad. That's basically removed from the game. So there's canned vegetable. Yeah. Canned food. Three vegetables. One, two, three. Two raw food, was it? Let's have a look. Does it say? Yeah, sure. Yeah, two. Yeah. That. They go in the waste bag. So that, oh. means, that means that we're still it's one. It's going to be harder to get now. Well, there's still one. Two, still some left. Yeah, two vegetables, two, oh, three vegetables. Okay. Three raw food. Mm hmm. And one canned food. Right. Still available to, to pick up. Mm. So it's less, but it's not dire. Okay. Well, not more at the moment, but not that's yet. it. Not After you resolve this card, remove it from the game. Mm -hmm. Okay. But that didn't remove the snipers, the snipers no, still that's out there. No, still there. Okay. Because the, 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 these cards are only removed. Mm. Well, this one is that if at least one character was hit immediately removed from the game, and normally these get removed if another card goes into the fight. Yeah. So the sniper is still there, mm -hmm. unfortunately. I mean, we could go and use... No, stop it, stop it, Sydney. Since the beach route was a beach <laughs> I said that, I didn't... No, 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 I shouldn't have said that. Bad man, bad mm. man. Okay, so that concludes the event phase. So the next thing we would do would be drawing the chapter card, right. which will tell us to look at this. So mm. we've got to try and keep it says on here, staying fit at the end of the chapter, all characters' hunger must be zero. Yeah. Reward, clear mind, immediately draw two narrative action cards and keep both. And we've seen how powerful these narrative action mm. cards are. Yeah. So, yeah. Okay. We're now into the day phase. Do the day actions where we do things in and around where we are. So, what do we need to improve the deadfall trap? Mm. Because that proved useful. Yeah. Um, we, so, if we improve the deadfall trap, mm -hmm. there's a plus three to the dice, which okay. means we can get more food out of it. Yeah. So, that's a potential build. Mm -hmm. The other things we were looking at was the 
building a workshop. Yep. Again, we've got two mechanical parts. So yeah. if we build the workshop, we can start building the board up. Board ups, and yeah. we've got board ups, but they mm. can't get through into the house. So that's, that's it, yeah. So that's potential. Mm -hmm. And then it was the herbal garden to then eventually improve the herbal garden to a vegetable garden. Again, one mechanical part. Mm. What can we build there straight away? We can cultivate herbs, roll cigarettes, prepare herbal meds. Mm. So one of those three, yeah. <coughs> I think we, we need to build. Right. Which do you think? Let's see. The workshop has one component. Oh, that's, all right. All right. And that's what we need. So to we build need a... ah, three wood, five components. Have we got enough? We've got plenty of wood. We've got five components. So we could build the workshop. Yeah. I think that's what we should go for. Yeah, and we've got a mechanical. We've got some mechanical parts. So yeah, let's do that. Let's do that then. Okay. okay so don't, no, not thing. yet. That, that that's what we get. We're, we're discussing what to do in the first that's action right. phase. Yeah, yeah. So we send someone off then as we mm -hmm. to go and build the workshop. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Right, so if you want to put that at the top there. This one. Yeah. Yeah. yeah all right up there. Stone, yes. And put that there. Mhm. Mm put this up there as well. With him. Yeah, of course. Cool. All right. So we've still got to get through the last rubble. Yeah. And Savita already is like, yeah, I'm going. Mm. I, know, I, I know my job. Actually, no, Savita, she's got two fatigue. Yeah. If we rest her. I think that would be a better idea, oh, put her on the bed. No, it's, it's not going to help. No? No, because if she's still going to only have, because of the wound. And she's so, ill. Yeah. No, I reckon, better go. It sounds cruel. Go and dig for you, but and then re re you're you're out of it. If we send Roman rather mm. than him, if we send him to sleep, yes, you know, he'll get his actions back. Mm. Okay, so Roman goes to bed. Right. Okay. Svita takes a shovel. Right. Okay. And then that leaves these two mm. young ladies. Um, Well, we need someone to put something in the deadfall trap. Yep. Yeah. Um, or do we... Uh, yep. Yeah. So, and that requires a chem. Mm, I don't think there's any chems. We do. We have, we have one chem. We have a chem, yeah. Okay. Okay. Right. So that's Amelia. Mm-hmm. Okay, we're going to need some wood for the... The heater, and we need obviously wood for the dead for, uh, for the workshop, and then some boarding up. So, if we send her to go and pug about, mm -hmm. and hopefully she'll find some more wood. Okay. And that's everyone allocated. So, dead fall trap is the easy one. Remove that to put a weight token back on it. Okay. And then we need we're going to need some more chems. Yeah. Okay, um, Roman recovers his fatigue by sleeping. Mm-hmm. She's back. And she's back. Yeah. Zavita digs through the last part of the rubble. Yeah. The rubble's gone. Mm-hmm. And she then collapses exhausted. Mm. And then we've got the mooch about, or right. poke about, if you want to roll that. High is good. Five, which That's is two wood. Two wood. Because yeah, we need the wood to build. Components. So we'll have two wood. We'll have two wood. Okay. Oh, I'm chucking it. Oh, no. Chucking it about. Oh, indeed. Okay. Right. Yeah, we didn't send anyone to build the workshop, did we? Dear, oh dear. Oh, we were going to send Roman to yeah, build the workshop, but now he's resting. That's yeah. our first action phase done. Okay. Okay. So, second action phase, she can't do anything because she's too fatigued mm. and wounded and ill. Right. Okay. So, we'll put her in the bed, mm -hmm. but she's not going to get any benefit from the bed because yeah. it's not classed as an action. Okay. She's just sweating in there mm. and such forth. Mm -hmm. All right. So, let's not wait. Uh, so, send Roman up to build that workshop. Up work. to the workshop. To build it. Yeah. 
and one of these guys to put through the furniture, our last furniture. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. And we've got to do for so again. We don't. Yeah, there's no point using the heater mm. at the moment until we've actually got a maximum wood. So she might be going mooch about again. Okay. So yeah, roll for her. See if she gets any more. And this, again, high is good. Five. Five. Another two wood. Mm. Here we go. Okay. Let's have a look what's in the furniture. She comes back. What did she find? Ah. Ooh. Found raw food. A mechanical part. One mechanical part, one sugar and one wood. One wood. Okay. So, if I take five of these out and put it up here, we've recovered one wood. Okay? Mechanical part. And a mechanical part. And the raw food we've got. We need a raw food as well. And a sugar. And a sugar. And that's the last unexplored location in the house. That's been done. The house that's has been done. Okay, yeah. and then Roman mm -hmm. builds the board up. Right, so we need this one. Yeah. We need three wood. Three wood. One. Three. Yeah. So that's that. And, and five components. Five components. And one mechanical part. Yes. So we're building the workshop. One mechanical part, five components, three mm -hmm. wood, which then allows us to build the workshop. So we're done. Right. Yeah. Let's put the workshop there. Okay. Okay, so that's the second action round completed. We now go to the third action round, which only Roman and Amelia have one, because Amira is a little bit fatigued. So she goes now. Right, how much wood do we have remaining? We have five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten, okay. So one of the things we wanted to build was the board. The board. Okay. How many components do we have? We've got no more components. Oh, We've got no components right. left. Okay, we took when we went the last poke about. I'm mm. going to change that slightly because we should have checked on the card what we needed. Mm. So take away one wood right. and replace it with a component. Okay. <coughs> yeah, it's a bit of a retro guard, but we'd have we really checked the card. Is... Yeah. yeah. We want to make the board. Okay. Okay. So that will take one component and forward, mm -hmm. and that will leave us then how much wood? That would leave us. We've got four wood left, oh. and there's five. Yeah. That's five left. Okay. Oh, that's done. Right. So what I'm advocating for the two characters remaining. Mm -hmm. One goes to the workshop. Yeah. And builds a board up. Right. I don't put the... That's the five. Leave the five there mm -hmm. at the moment. Right. And then someone goes to the simple heater. Yeah. And puts in um, the five w remaining wood with one book, mm -hmm. which will then equal six, which yeah. will lower the cold by three. Yeah. Okay. You all right with that? Yeah. Yeah, that's good. So it doesn't matter which one we send there each one right so that means using one component and forward mm -hmm. have you discarded this all it's yeah. all gone it's all gone so we've got a little empty box now mm. okay so we get one board up that's one yep. of the big round one under the weight right so there's something down there yeah here we go all right so we're going to board up this hole here yeah all right mm -hmm. um and then we put in, we lower the cold by three by putting yeah. five wood and one book. So we lower the cold there. Okay, we've got two books left. That book is yeah. gone. Yeah. <clears throat> I mean, okay. we've read that one multiple times. Yeah. So. 
and that ends mm -hmm. the action phase. Right. So yeah, I know we, we it's not cheap, if we just double checked on the card mm -hmm. that we needed a component to make the border, I thought it was purely wood. Yeah. And when we did the poker belts, mm -hmm. we could choose wood or components, which yeah. is taking one less wood, which we mm -hmm. completed and took the extra component. Right. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. um, so that's the day actions finished. Mm -hmm. So everybody now returns back yep. to the guard spot. We're at dusk. So we'll go through water. Now we've only got one water. Mm -hmm. And either it will raise their hunger or their misery by one. Uh. Now, the other thing we could do is keep the water, let mm -hmm. everyone roll on that dice, so our misery's not looking too bad. Yeah. And our hunger, we've got the food to deal with. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I reckon keep the water. Yeah. Because okay. with water, we can then um, make, with the sugar, we can make moonshine. That's it! Right. I don't mind going home and bring me my booze! So, yeah. So, no one's consuming water. Mm -hmm. So, we've got four rolls to make. So, this is for Savita. See if she gets more miserable or she gets hungry. Okay. Low, one to five is hunger, six to ten is misery. One. Okay. So, her hunger goes up by one. And then now roll for Roman. Mm -hmm. Five. Five. His hunger goes up by one. Okay. Amira. Mm -hmm. Ten. Ten. She gets, well, she gets her first step of misery back. Right. Doing it water. You were, we're, we're doing it for the booze. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yep. And then finally, Amelia. A six. Her misery. Goes to one. Mm -hmm. Okay, so it wasn't too bad. Yeah. Right, so now then hunger, we've got two on level one. Mm -hmm. That's the only two that's on level one. So now what have we got? Raw food. Got two raw food, one canned food, but no vegetables. If we'd had vegetables, we could have kept the hunger at the same. Mm -hmm. Okay, so if we use the canned food. Yeah. Right. And the other thing about eating, we've got to eat, we've definitely got to eat now, mm. but we can also eat later in the round. And yeah. eat that you can eat at any time. Mm -hmm. um, that was something I found when I was reading the Frequently Asked Questions, because it seems like if you're, you're playing the game, you're right, this is the only time in the day I found a can of food and you can't eat it. No, dinner time's at four o'clock in the morning. Okay. You know, no, that someone did clarify that. You can eat at any time, but you okay. must eat at this time if you want to, to mm. lower it. Yes. At this point. Yeah. So we're going to use a canned food. Yeah. All right. Mm -hmm. To lower their hunger one point each. That's so it. So that's uh, Savita and Roman. Mm-hmm. All right. Consume the canned food. So and then because <clears throat> yeah we've got no we could lower the hunger of Emira and Emily by eating raw food. Mm-hmm. But the hunger's at zero. Yeah. So their hunger's now go to one mm -hmm. each at the end of this phase. Right. Remember, so we, we, we'll, have them we'll later on in the turn, yeah. you know, if we get a vegetable, we can, you know, we can get them to eat vegetables. Yes. And remembering she, uh, Amira, is good at finding vegetables. Yeah. So we'll just have to wait and see at the moment. Remember, we've got to try and get them all to zero mm -hmm. on the hunger scales. Yeah. So we're, we're, we're mostly there. Mm. Right, evening. Okay, well, Savita is one that needs to go to sleep. Mm. But she's on fatigue too. Yeah. Okay. So we'll put her on the bed. Yeah. So let me go. just show you on, on here, guys. So <coughs> at the present moment, Savita, with her fatigue too, or actually she's got wounds and illnesses, hopefully we'll find some bandages and we've definitely got meds to deal with this. But fatigue, she needs to sleep. So mm -hmm. we're putting her to bed. Okay. Um, and that instantly, on for the night, we should recover that fatigue. Yeah. Okay. Um, guard duty. Mm. Now, we've still got that sniper to deal with. Yes. But we, we don't we need to go out. Mm. 
So Rome is the best, and the Amelia, the lawyer, she's the next best to deal with. Um, she's got a prowess of one. So if we send those two out, yeah, keeping Amira guarding the property. Yeah. That way we can hopefully pick up some more stuff. Yeah. All right. Yeah. I think that would be a good idea. Getting Roman out there, because he wasn't in the army, it would be the first choice. Uh, um, well, we saw last time he, he yes. wasn't really able to carry that much back, was he? No. Okay. But um, we'll... And we definitely need bandages. We need bandages, that's for sure. So, yeah. Um, we could I, have... I, I would suggest not going to the warehouse because we know there's thugs there. Yeah, we'd best leave that. So, the garage, we get more mechanical and electrical parts, mm. or the construction site where we can get some vegetables. I think the construction site would be the one to go to. Okay. Yes. Alright, so we're sending out Roman. Yeah. That means he accumulates a fatigue point. Mm hmm. We're sending out. Um, Amelia. Amelia, so yeah. she accumulates a fatigue point. Yeah. And Amira, on guard duty, accumulates a fatigue point. So mm. she'll be sleeping during the day. Yeah. Tomorrow. Mm. Okay, let's bring this back. We'll take those two out. Mm -hmm. We've done all the fatigue, so we've got to work out what we're taking with us. So we're definitely going to take a pistol. Yeah. With Two ammo. Yeah. And a knife, leaving the hatchet with guard the property. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Then we want to take some trade goods. Mm-hmm. Is it? Oh, I put yeah, you put it there. Yeah. You're going to take and a, a knife. knife. Okay, that leaves one ammo for the pistol. Mm -hmm. Take the two shells, take a weapon part, all this that we can trade. Yeah. Um, oh yeah, we do need some chems for the um, mm. deadfall trap. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, we're going to the uh, uh, construction site, so we need, it's got rubble, so we'll take a shovel. Yeah. And it's got bars, so we need the, the saw blade. blade. Okay, mm -hmm. um, we'll take a meds to trade. Yeah. Herbal meds to trade. Yeah. We need the sugar. We'll take a couple of fags. Yeah. Uh, and a herb. Mm. None of these weighing things in a coffee. Okay. It's all things to trade because someone might want all these things. Right, okay. Okay. So I'm going to pile of pile shit, mm. basically. Oh, and. We've got that valuable trinket, haven't we, which is worth 10. Ah, yes. Okay. Right, so that's the stuff we're taking mm -hmm. with us. And therefore, she will be defending with the pistol. Yeah. Okay, let's go out and explore. Mm -hmm. Question is now, we decided to go to the construction site. So, let's see if we can avoid the sniper. Okay. Can I roll this? Because last, yes. last time it was very close. It was. Not say, I mean, it, a die roll is just a die roll. We've got, we've <laughs> got no control be, over it. Right. Okay, it's so I'm going gonna, gonna to do um, Emily first, because mm -hmm. she has got one reroll option. Mm -hmm. Okay, so she's potentially taking two wounds. Don't like the look of that. Oh, yeah. So let's do her again. This is a uh, one and only reroll. Okay, that is a blank for if it, if it was a shotgun that a sniper was armed with, and snipers aren't armed with shotguns. So mm -hmm. she managed to avoid a bullet very close. And then Roman, he's got three roll, re rolls after this initial roll. Mm -hmm. That's a blank. So he's okay. Right. Phew. Mm. Um, next up, I think it's a blank. Let me just double check. I think that's plus the bank on this. If the SO gun is rolled on a combat die, 
See, this wasn't a combat die. This, well, it is a combat die. Yours or enemies. You must choose if, if it is a miss or you or if you trust fate. Mm. Uh, so we have a choice. Right. I don't know. Uh, it's a miss. I, I'd rather not try, go to fate. And, and <laughs> fate might make me gain something, but it could mm. also mean something. The main thing is we need to get him out. Yeah. So we've managed to s s avoid sniper, mm. which is a good thing. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not trusting the fate. I don't really know what those fake cards mm -hmm. say on the little uh, fake dice. Mm -hmm. Okay, next up is we draw. So we're going to the closest one, the construction site, wasn't it? So yes, so we have 14, 14 yeah. of these cards. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, fourteen. Right, so they go into the unknown. Mm -hmm. Now, at the construction site, shall we have a mooch about first? Yes, we can. See what, have a look around, and there might be someone to, we can actually trade with. Yeah. So if we return to exploration cards, mm -hmm. have a look around the area, see 114. Okay. So if you want to find 114, yeah. and I will discard two. While Simon's doing that, I just to remind you guys, if you hit the like button, it all helps the channel and promotes it via the algorithm. Remember, all <coughs> comments are much appreciated. And if you haven't subscribed yet so far, please do so. Thank you very much. Right, right this is a roll in the black die. Okay. Okay. Right, so... right, let's see. Let's see which chapter we go to. Two. Two, so it tells us to 1901. One nine oh one, right. The stench of decay is unbearable. These bodies must have been months old. They're in the extreme state of decay and are falling apart. Nice. Some have bullet holes in their heads but no other obvious signs of violence. Are they rebels killed by the army? Prisoners shot by rebels? However, did this, uh, did this try to conceal the crime by flooding the basement? Maybe they intended to collapse the building and bury the evidence under the rubble. Roll the black die and compare the results with the empathy of each character present. A result that is equal to or lower than the character's empathy. Raise their misery by one. Okay, not a very pleasant sight. No. Both of our characters, Emily and Roman's, empathy is three. Mm -hmm. So if we roll a one, two or three, then misery is raised by one. If we roll a four, five or higher, yeah, whatever. Yeah, whatever. Mm. I've seen enough bodies around this, this city. <coughs> A couple more. Mm. Doesn't bother either of them. Okay. All right. Mm. Okay. So it didn't give us anything. Mm -hmm. But if we rolled on, because it was obviously random event to see which of those paragraphs, one of them could have been good. But yeah. It wasn't. Yeah. All right. If you want to draw the first expiration card then. Okay. Okay. Okay, I think I saw something. Return as many expiration cards as you wish and roll the black die. Add the number of the returned expiration cards to the result. A result of one to five, draw and resolve a residence card. Okay, <clears throat> I want to avoid residence. Mm -hmm. so the more we put, um, so if we put two in, yeah. or in expiration cards, mm -hmm. that'll add to the dice, uh, a one to five, so that means that'll be one to three. Mm -hmm. Put three cards in, that'll make it a one or a two. Mm -hmm. How many cards should, or should we just, if we get a resident, we get a resident. Uh, yeah, we'll just Trump take the dice. some, roll the dice and see, see we, what we got. See if we get lucky. Okay. Come on then. This all means I can blame you, of course. Yeah, of course. Of course. Six. Six. Got through it. Mm. 
I think I saw something. We saw nothing. So we're okay. We're okay on that one? Yeah. Right, jam door. Don't blame me for that. <laughs> no, there is no, there is no jam door, so therefore we draw one of those. Okay. Basement entrance, there is no basement entrance, so we keep drawing until... Right, search, you may ignore this card or search the furniture. I think mm -hmm. we'll search the furniture. Yeah. Return two expiration cards or raise the noise by one. Let's, we want to be as quiet as possible, so we put two expiration cards back mm -hmm. and we then search the furniture. And we find a herb. A herb. A herb. Yeah. And a mechanical pot. Yeah. In the mechanical pot. Oh. Chems, but no herbs. Right. Okay, so. And there's a weapons part as well. A weapons part. Okay, so. And then, and the then a die roll. roll. Okay. Mm -hmm. So seven to nine will give us another vegetable, or five or six, another mechanical part. A three. three is now. Oh dear. However, I will take a vegetable as mm -hmm. her free vegetable that she's allowed to actually accumulate. Okay. All right, so that's that card done. Put that over there. Try to draw mm -hmm. the next expiration card. Okay. We're still wanting something like bandages, so we need. I think we might need something to trade. With. Yes. Search the heap. Okay. So again, return to expiration cards and raise the noise by one, or raise the noise by one. Right. Return to expiration cards. And we can search the heap. Right. And there is a broken guitar. Oh. Yeah, a broken guitar. Yeah. And, and there's a shell. Yeah. And a die roll. A shell and a die roll. Yep. Yeah. Exploration card. Yes, we can. Um, stairs up. Look for another way. Return two exploration cards or enter. Raise the noise by two and roll for the noise. Okay, well, my thinking here mm. is that we need to find someone to trade with. Yeah. So maybe we should enter and raise the noise by two mm -hmm. and see whom we attract right and hopefully it's not a thug mm. so raise the noise by two yep and then roll <coughs> for the noise roll for the noise so four or higher we don't attract anybody a ten no we don't attract anyone so that's good okay in its own way all right so next card is search the furniture mm. turn to expressions or raise the noise and roll for noise Ideally, we want some civilians and who we can trade with, but it could be a bunch of thugs again. Mm. Alright, we've got two characters this time, but we might get unlucky on a thug roll and get four thugs. Mm. And now we don't have a smoke bomb. That's true. Oh, okay. And they'd be probably quicker on the gun than we are. Yeah. So, I shall we be as quiet again? Yeah. We've only got three exploration cards, we still haven't found a bandage. Uh, but there might be one in the furniture. So. 
Okay. Turn two of those. Mm -hmm. Shuffle the findings deck again. Come on. We're looking at furniture. Come on, we need bandage. Oh, we get more meds. Oh, furniture. Oh, we get more meds. Sugar. Well, we can't get any more meds because we're using all the med counters. No, we've got no more meds. There's sugar and a lockpick and a diary. Sugar. Mm-hmm. A lockpick. There's only more lockpicks, so that no. must be rubbish for us. So, it's a die roll. So we picked up another bag of sugar. Four. Four, that's nothing. Mm -hmm. So that got us one bag of sugar. Yeah. Alright, so that was a bit. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. Okay. So our last exploration card. <sighs> yeah, the very last one. Closed door. Pick you know, the lock. No, there is no closed door here, so that means so we draw the next it. we draw the next okay. card from the exploration. Okay, hideout. Uh, return as many exploration cards as yeah. you wish. Useless for us. So we found very little out there tonight. Yeah. Which happens. Mm -hmm. Um hopefully we won't you know we won't until we can get any worse. So <clears throat> what are we bring him back? So let's see. Obviously, we'll bring back our knife and our pistol. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The ammo. So that's. So we can carry back between six. So that's two. Yeah. Um, vegetable doesn't cost anything. Mechanical part three. Mechanical part four. Okay. Shell is free. The meds is free. The herbals is free, saw blades free, shovel five. Well, do we need a shovel now? Uh, we'll, we'll think about that because we've got nothing to yeah, dig around our nothing house. Nothing to dig around the house uh, now, so. Cigarettes free, coffee, herbs are free. I mean, these are things we brought with us to trade with. Yeah. Again, a couple of shells, all free. Weapon parts, so. All right, so we've got one, two, uh, shovel, three. Mm. Mechanical parts, four, five. We can only carry six. Right. <clears throat> um, so, sugar, do we have sugar? We have sugar. We have sugar. Weapon parts, we've got weapons, so we don't need to make weapons. And broken guitar, we haven't got anything to fix a broken guitar. All right. Um, Water? Yeah, we do need water. All right, so bring back one additional water then. Okay. That will be one, two, three, two mechanical parts, four, five, six. So we bring back one water. We dump in the sugar, the broken guitar, and the weapon parts. Yeah. Ideally, right, we want something to trade with. But there was nobody. That's, that's the risk of the residence deck. You know, yeah. you, you just don't know who, mm. what, or where you're going to get. That's it. All right. Okay, the night raid. What's going to happen at night in the night raid? Someone is breaking into our house and we've got the mirror on the case. So mm -hmm. the night raid deck, there are four cards. Mm -hmm. Shuffling those. And we get hobos. <coughs> okay, so damage is three tokens but no wounds. But she can shoot the pistol. Yeah. All right. To lower the amount of damage, effectively, you know, if she manages to chase them off a little bit. Yeah. So three wounds on this and we don't take any damage. Two. Two. Okay, so we take one. Mm -hmm. One damage. She has, she has no, yeah, she has no reroll option. Okay. And I just realized if we didn't get the vegetable, it was the wrong person we should be sent out. Mm. Yeah, because the vegetable was picked up by her, so we yeah. didn't get the vegetable. Right. So if any of you were screaming at the screen saying, no, no, you didn't pick up the vegetable. Yeah, we just sort of finally corrected it. Mm -hmm. Okay. So she uses the ammo. Mm -hmm. So the hobos do damage to us, but they, they will take the most expensive item we have here. Yes. Which is what? They nick our hatchet. 
Starting oh. with the most expensive ones. Yes. The meds are 10, the hatchet mm. is 12. Mm. So if we'd armed her, well, then again, if we'd armed her with a hatchet, mm. she, they would have nicked the pistol. So the hatchet goes. They would have nicked the so. hatchet. <clears throat> and then afterwards, remove this card from the game. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, it's gone. That's the night raid concluded. Mm -hmm. We then go to the dawn. So the scavenging party returns. So they just come back. Yep. She comes off the bed. And we put everything back. So right. I'll pause the program while we program the episode. Okay, so we've got everyone back. And we can assign meds and bandages. So we haven't got any bandages, but we do have meds. Right. So we're going to assign meds to Savita, mm -hmm. if she's the only one that's ill. Um, now, full meds, if the, the fake card allows it, that will actually recover her, while herbal meds will just keep her stage, stage stable. Mm -hmm. stable. Okay. Um, at this point, if we want to have our, to fulfill the objective. Okay. Um, we can get extra card. I'm going to use the two raw food. Yeah. Okay, to lower their hunger by ones. Mm. So what I'm doing on here, because you can eat at any time, these two guys aren't hungry, these two are. We're going to lower their hunger because a raw food lowers hunger by one. Right. I'd hope we'd pick up a bit more, but we didn't. But there we go. So mm. those are no longer hungry. So we'll have no one hungry when we come to do the, the chapter card. Okay. Right, well, I hope anyway. That's the fake card that says otherwise. Mm-hmm. Okay. Um, draw a fake card. You want to shuffle the fake cards up? Right. And we'll draw one and see what we get. Okie dokie. Right, so here's a card for you. All right, it's the fake card. So it says, raise the illness of all ill characters who did not take any meds or herbal meds by one. We did. Mm. Discard herbal meds token from all characters. So the meds didn't do anything other than stopped her getting any worse. Mm. Um, but we didn't have any herbal meds, it wasn't full meds, so we'd have to told her to get, rid, get rid of anything. Okay, and her wound didn't get any worse, so that's okay. okay. If cold tokens minus board ups equals four or more, well, okay, so the cold token is at one, mm -hmm. and we have a board up with one, so that's at zero, so we don't suffer anything there. And it says exchange the nearest location, so we lose the construction site. Mm -hmm. And we will come down by one. Next location up is a derelict. There's a cigarette there as well. <laughs> yeah, that don't, don't, lose, don't lose a cigarette. <laughs> right. You get a derelict squat. Mm. Mm, okay. Doesn't sound too tempting to go to, does it? Mm, no. No. Then it says resolve weight tokens. All right. So we have the deadfall trap. Mm-hmm. Okay. So we need to resolve that. Yeah. And high is good. Mm-hmm. That's the D10. Let's hope it's a good one. A seven. seven. Seven is we get one more food. Oh well. And eight would have been That's two. Good. That's why we might, might need to improve it. Mm. Right, and it says resolve spirit A. So going through the characters, spirit A on uh, Zavita. If any character in the group is hungry, level three, raise her misery by one. No one's, at hung no one's hungry at all. Roman spirit A. Habit, discard one cigarette from the storage, which we can do. Yep. We can that satisfy his need. Amira, spirit. Habit, discard one moonshine or 100% alcohol. No, it's not Sorry, the, the, the hobos nicked it yesterday, or this is scarring people. So her misery is raised by one, so she goes to misery too. Mm. Okay, and Emily, the lawyer, discard one coffee to stop okay. her misery going up. So we'll discard those. Mm. Okay, so we lost a cigarette, and Amira's going, Where's my moonshine? We didn't have, we didn't have time. And then yeah. put that back in the fake deck. Yeah. Okay. And then narrative, we draw two narrative cards and we get to choose one of them. Right. Two. 
two of them, yeah. Mm -hmm. So we've got duty, which is play during the day actions phase, raise one chosen character's fatigue by one to automatically remove a rubble, rubble remnants card without losing it. We've got no rubble left in the building, so that's no, not, that's not, good. not good. That'd have been earlier good in the game. Kick the door down. Play during the day actions phase or during the scavenging phase, you automatically open a closed door. Mm. I think the door one would be better. Well, the other one's no use to us at all. Absolutely. And kicking down the door might be useful. So okay. Just, so I'm trying to put that. Unfortunately, it's got to go back in the narrative actions. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> and that's it. So. Yes, let us look back on the past day. How did we do? What will we need next? What must be scavenged or traded? What should we build? And let's see what tomorrow will bring us. Let's bring this back up to the top. Mm -hmm. Again, not too bad, but not perfect. Mm. It didn't we, we needed to trade and we had no one to trade with. That's right. So the risk of trading, as I say, those residents, there's always the risk that we're going to get someone nasty like the hobos and such forth. If we have a quick look at the resident deck, all right, there are rats. Can't really trade with a rat. No. Well, you, yeah. <laughs> You're a rat bird. There are rebels. There are survivors. So that's one probable good one. Rebels. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, the rebels could offer items. Reality impact. Thugs. Soldiers. Survivors. More thugs. Um, deserters. Deserters. Civilians. Civilians. More rats and more hobos mm. so the likelihood is that you're going to get someone who's soldiers we could just surrender to them mm -hmm. and then we could then maybe talk to them yeah thugs they just want to take our stuff mm. survivors there's a chance of trade mm. well deserters they want to take our stuff civilians are keen to trade rats obviously can't trade and hobos they could go either way so yeah, it's not. There's not many people to trade with, and I thought maybe if we go and search around the places, so that it might give us something to trade with. Yeah, it hasn't. So <clears throat> I know in the expansion there is an actual marketplace which always gives you an option to trade, um, but we're not playing the expansion. Not yet, anyway. <laughs> so yeah. Hmm disappointing on that part but yeah. that will conclude chapter two so we're then going into this basically three more turns to go yeah to, before we finish finish the actual game we haven't lost a character yet touching wood um though we have one who's uh, zavita who's not one of the important characters she's a guest star if it was a tv show yes yeah. yes that's right that's right um but she's been here for a few days now she has proved useful in a few ways, but she's still the one with the wound and the illness. Mm. So we have got her on meds. Okay. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that. I did. Yeah, I did too. It was really good. Okay, the story Brilliant. continues. Yep. Um, yeah. So and then, until next time, remember, play games, have fun, and we'll see you in the next episode. Okay, bye. Bye, Internet. <laughs>